wide reader is someone that's curious. They'll maybe be involved in one industry that we cover, but they want to find out about a really broad range of things. So they want to be surprised about what's happening in the finance sector. They want to be surprised about what's happening in Silicon Valley startups. They want to be surprised about what's happening in China, in India. So we sort of bring that diversity um, to their general curiosity, but they're experts as well. At Wired, we like to try and tell stories that are detailed, in-depth, have a good analysis, have really good access to um, the people that can make decisions and make change in the world around them. So we like to speak to the people that have um, the ability to make a decision within their organisation and actually how that affects the wider world. To get into Wired, the most important things, really simple three things, access, exclusivity and timing. And they all kind of tie together a little bit. So particularly as a PR pitching a story, you know you've got an announcement coming up, you've got a big product launch, you've got a big report coming out, you've got an amazing piece of work that you want to tell the world about. Don't come to us with it at four o'clock on a Thursday when the embargo is at 7 a.m. on a Friday morning. We need a good number of days. Imagine how long you would like someone to spend on that story to tell it really well. We can't do it in just a few hours. Um, and the exclusivity thing kind of ties into that again. So if you trust us to tell the story that you want to tell, give us the access, give us the time to do it. Um, let us speak to the right people. And that's how we do the best journalism, both in terms of working with PRs, but also working with journalists and going out there into the world and trying to get underneath stories and report them. So a perfect pitch for me would be something that is tailored to Wired, that is tailored to our readership, that is tailored to the sort of stories we tell. So that's somebody coming to us with uh, a knowledge of the publication, um, what we normally write about and the sort of uh, requirements that we need. So often we like to have access for stories, so we need to be able to speak to the people that are building the technologies or know how they work and can go into the detail because we like to really focus on uh, specific elements, so making things that are technical, not technical. Wired USP is that we're wired. I think that, that makes quite a big difference. A lot of our competitors are technology titles straight, so they'll do gadget reviews, they'll do how-to guides as to how to use technology. That's a small part of what we do, but we're probably competing alongside the T3s and the stuffs. We're going up against The Economist and The Financial Times, our sister titles, the other wires across the world, to kind of tell the stories about how all those different things are intersecting. And it's not just about gadgets and gizmos, it's about how social networks are affecting our democracies, it's about how devices are changing the way we live our lives. It's, it's not just simple stories, it's the complex stuff.